Hello, my beasties. Welcome to the lair. Today we are going to field strip the Para Ordnance P14 and 45 caliber. This is a double stacked 1911 pistol. Para safety is always paramount with firearms. As always, we're gonna make sure the gun is safe. We are gonna remove the magazine, lock our action back. We are gonna check the mag well and look down the barrel to make sure it is safe. You are then going to press the recoil spring plug in so it is flush or slightly below the barrel bushing. I generally use a little piece of plastic to do it because the recoil spring plug and spring are very stiff. You will rotate the bushing 45 degrees to the left and then remove the spring. When you do this, keep some tension on it, otherwise it will go flying and you will play Where's Waldo with the spring. You are then going to pull the slide back until the lug on the left measures, lines up with the slide clearing notch at this point you're going to push in the slide stop pin on the other side and very carefully remove the slide stop. You will then slide the action forward off the frame. You will lift the spring assembly rod up and to the rear like in most pistols. You are then going to turn the bushing 90 degrees opposite to the right and remove the bushing from the muzzle. Then find the link on the barrel, which will be in the 12 o'clock position. Push it forward into the 9 o'clock position, and you'll be able to remove the barrel through the front of the pistol. When putting this back together, as always, make sure your slide lock still works. Make sure... Your safety still clicks off and on, and that your action moves freely and is not binding or catching anywhere. This particular pistol does have a beaver tail grip safety and a thumb safety. The reason I use a piece of plastic is they're cheap and easily replaceable. I personally carry this condition one, which is also known as cocked and locked. It has a round in the chamber, but the safety is on because this is a single action pistol. If you have any other questions or there's a gun you specifically would like to see, let me know down there in the comments. I appreciate you all. To all my beasties, I hope you have a wonderful night. Thank you for joining me in the lair. I can't wait till next time. See you then.